All right, so this structure here is one of the other bigger structures on the property. This was owned by a kids camp or a daycare camp. It used to be called Jolly Fun. It's got a big porch on here. It's got a new roof. Uh, it's about 3,000 square feet. You're right here by the first entrance. You've got parking right across the street. You've got Grove Run right behind you. And uh, you've got the pool right here. And this is something that I've been praying about. I feel like that's this, the is, pool. this is what God has that's prepared for me. That's the pool area. Yep. I believe like this is what God has for me. Um, but I'm not positive about that. It may, it's, it's, like a, it's like a little seed in my heart right now. Uh -huh. uh, it does need a lot of work. The side of the house here is starting to come out. The floor <laughs> inside of it is like this on the first floor. Um, but yeah, so this might be a project that I'm undertaking. Or unless God has other plans, maybe it's for somebody else. So I put that on the offering block Keep and say, Lord, if, uh, if you have something better in mind, I don't want to be greedy. But this is Grove 1 here that we're looking at. These are all the picnic tables that we set up. With um, the Canada honkers? Yeah, yeah. Wah, wah, wah. So this, uh, this over here is the community house up front. Oh. A ministry just bought that, and they haven't been doing anything with it. And so if they don't do something soon with it, I was thinking about maybe uh, reaching out and giving it to TLR or something. We don't know yet. So but that uh, that would be a nice place of community. you got basketball courts over here. you got a baseball diamond. This is where the Norwegian tabernacle was that fell down after they took a center support out of it to put in a basketball hoop. And then they had a big snowstorm, and the thing fell down. This is about 20 years ago. Oh, yeah. wow. It shows you that you need to keep a sure foundation. Don't try and seek after entertainment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What's that bracket up there? Uh... Don't know. Where you do pull-ups? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of interesting. Yeah. Pull-ups on the roof. It's a dangerous place. Oh, you know what it is? What? I believe it holds maybe a flower rack. Oh yeah, it could be a yeah. Yep. Could be a. It'd be a flower rack. Window box or. Yeah. Window yeah. box. Right? Yeah. I think it's what it was. Flower box. This cottage is for sale. Uh, it needs to get some attention ASAP. This possibly could be an adopt one or a very low price tag. The shed here, or the porch on the back, needs to be rebuilt. The cool thing about this, nobody around is it. there's no one around it. This is your own kind of special cottage out here. Uh, it's probably a one-bedroom, simple, small cottage. But wow, talk look about all, look all just around. having your own privacy out here. You've got the two groves behind you. You've got basketball courts over here. You've got a community garden, and we're starting over here on the side of it. And you've yeah. got the outdoor bathrooms here. you got parking right across the street. This is a neat little cottage right here. And, uh, yeah, excited to see what's going on. Oh, okay. So, so what? tell me about this garden. So this is something that we just did about a month ago. We had a gentleman who said, I want to build a garden here. So he brought his excavator over and scraped off the top grass. And he had all these already started. And he said, can I bring them in here and do this? And we said, absolutely. So we've got cabbage growing here. We've got tomatoes. We've got, uh, I think, some squash down there. I don't know if we've got some watermelon. Um, so, yeah, we just put the fence up around it to keep the deer out of it. And, uh, yeah, awesome. This is the other bigger structure on the building. Four kids only is a day camp where kids come in, they play. Uh, moms drop off the kids and they go to work or whatever. And uh, they're not allowed in here this year because of COVID and all that other stuff. That nonsense. But anyways... You see, the, kids only day camp. Idea there. Yeah. The upper area has a whole bunch of cots or bedrooms, and so if people ever need a place to stay, we could probably set up something like that for rentals. Pool table, big bar. And now you can see the front of 17 Kingsley. This is the one that's already elevated. You got parking right next to it, and this is just a wonderful time. We have a few more down here to show you, and we'll get to that in a second. Okay. Did you get the caretaker? 